Ashley from Ashley's Got Book Excitement, and I'm here to do my October TBR. Since I didn't meet my goal for September, I think I'm just gonna I'm just gonna try six books this month to see if I can read six. This isn't a concrete list. I might change what I'm reading. It all depends on what I feel, but this this is the plan as of right now. First, what I'd like to do is. I'd like to read two review books that I got because I'd feel kind of bad if I didn't read them. So I want to read I Frankenstein by Becca Black because she was nice enough to send this to me and I enjoyed the first one and it should be a short read. It's written in like uh, texts and emails and yeah, it's got picture. It just has. It's a very cool format for a book, and I think it'll be fun to read in October because it it is a Halloween read. So I plan. I want to get through that one just because I feel bad if I didn't. So that's one of them. I also want to read uh, Cameo by Tennille because this was also sent to me. And this is, it's just really short. It's like 200 pages. So I should finish that, hopefully. So I want to get these two done, because I'd feel bad if I didn't. The one I'm reading right now is The Hunt by Andrew Fukuda. I am 46 pages in. It's different. It, it's like this kid is living among the vampires. And all the rest of the humans are kind of gone because humans are a delicacy to vampires. Like, they not only suck their blood, they rip their flesh and eat them. And I don't know how this kid is, like, hiding in plain sight, really. Because don't, can't vampires hear, like, heartbeats and, like, smell blood? You know, can't they tell that this kid is human? Anyway, that's beside the point. It's, but it's pretty good so far. This... There's like this lottery going down where a lucky few are chosen to participate in this hunt where like captive humans are let loose and these vampires are allowed to chase after them. This kid, he's chosen randomly by this lottery and he's really a human in disguise with these vampires. So yeah, that's Halloween. Good, right? Yeah. Then I want to read The Book of Blood and Shadow by Robin Wasserman. One Girl, One Night, Centuries of Secrets. When I was reading it, the synopsis earlier, it almost kind of reminded me of, like, The Da Vinci Code. I don't know if that's right at all, but it has that feeling of, like, yeah, stuff's going down. But it's kind of a pretty... Anyway, I want to get through that one. Uh, then I want to continue on with the Gone series, and I want to read Hunger. This is the second book. It's just as humongous as the first. I think that's Kane on the cover. Oh, Kane and Diana. And I think that's Sam and Astrid. My goodness, I have to find out what happens next because... Ah! And then I had this one on so many TBR piles. And I think I really am going to get to it in October. It's a Blood Harvest by S.J. Bolton. Scary... Haunted House, Missing Children, I think, something like that. And I really need to get this read so I can bring it back to the library. Also, if I have time, I really want to get this one read, Anna Dressed in Blood, because I have heard nothing but great things about this book, and I really want to read it. So that's all. That's my TBR. Comment me, tell me what you guys are going to planning on reading for the month of October. If you have videos, let me know. I'll check them out. I like watching them. And that's it. I'll see you guys later. Bye!